this is another episode of Misty Disturbed. Thanks to Kanye West. I know I love talking about Kanye, but his rants are just so fascinating. So he's gotten himself into a rap feud with Jimmy Kimmel. Interesting, so I'm gonna tell you everything that's happened and then at the end of this video, you can decide are you on Team Kimmel or Team Kanye? So Kanye recently did this epic interview with BBC Radio where he said a slew of outrageous comments such as he has done more than Michael Jackson, he invented leather jogging pants, he is the number one rock star on the planet because rap is the new rock and roll. So of course, Jimmy Kimmel being the jokester that he is, he made a spoof video of the interview. It's called Kimmel's Kid Recreation where he used a couple kid actors to say some of the exact lines that Kanye used in the interview. Take a look. But the Leonard Dog fan six years ago to Fendi and they said no. How many <laughs> have you done seen with Leonard Dog fans? Where's the culture at? So Kanye's pissed about that video. We, I don't really don't think it's that bad because it's using his exact words. It's just using kids, so it's kind of harmless. And Kanye, you're a dad now, you should get it. So Kanye went on a Twitter rant. Here's some of the tweets he sent out that are completely outrageous. Jimmy Kimmel is out of line to try and spoof in any way the first piece of honest media in years. Followed by, Jimmy Kimmel, I don't take it as a joke. You don't have scumbags hopping over fences trying to take pictures of your daughter. Jimmy Kimmel, put yourself in my shoes. Oh no, that means you would have gotten too much pee in your life. Followed by many other tweets and one including Ben Affleck. Should I do a spoof about your face or are you fucking Ben Affleck? Hashtag no disrespect to Ben Affleck. <laughs> and there's more where that came from, including a couple photos that just totally take this rant over the top. Did Kanye make these? If so, that's impressive. Or did he go to some meme generator and make it still impressive that Kanye knows how to make memes on the internet. And additionally, Kanye called Jimmy right before his show that night, this was on Thursday, and told him that he needed to publicly apologize to Kanye for the spoof video. And did Jimmy do that? No. No, he did not do that, but what he did instead was read all the ridiculous tweets that Kanye sent out on his show and just make fun of him even more. And ended by thanking Kanye, saying, now I'm in a rap feud, and he was pretty happy about that. The ball's really now in Kanye's court after he did not publicly apologize. But in my opinion, kind of seems like Kanye needs to apologize now for all those ridiculous tweets, and the playing field is totally even right now because Jimmy did the spoof, Kanye did the Twitter rant. I don't know what's gonna happen next, but you guys tell me, whose side are you on? And do you think this will just end now? People's be buzzing and talking about it all over the internet, just like me. Okay, if you want more of Misty Disturbed, you should subscribe to my channel, Misty Kingma.